This is the weather bulletin published by Pagasa at 4 p.m. of October 29, 2020. Pagasa is monitoring two weather disturbances outside the Philippine area of responsibility. First, severe tropical storm with international name, Goni. As of 3 p.m. it was estimated to be 1,505 kilometers from the east of central Luzon. Goni has a maximum wind strength of 110 kilometers per hour near its center, and a gustiness of 135 kilometers per hour. It is moving west at an speed of 15 kilometers per hour. Another tropical depression is brewing east of Mindanao. As of 3 p.m., it is located 2,435 kilometers east of Mindanao, with a maximum wind strength of 55 kilometers near its center, and a gustiness of 70 kilometers per hour. It is moving west-northwest at a speed of 10 kilometers per hour. It is expected to enter the Philippine area of responsibility by Monday or Tuesday. And within 24 hours, it is expected to gain strength and become a tropical storm. As per forecast of severe tropical storm Goni's track, it will slightly dip down before veering up its direction. It will approach first the area in Bicol region and northern Samar, so expect that storm warning signal will be raised in these regions by Saturday. It is expected to land fall between Quezon and Aurora areas. If Goni maintains its direction and speed, it will exit the Philippine land mass by Monday afternoon. What to expect? Goni will enter par Thursday evening, moving towards the general direction of Quezon Aurora areas. It will possibly land fall on Sunday or by early morning of Monday. It will intensify into Typhoon category within 24 hours. For more information and updates, please visit these official sites of Dust Pagasa on Twitter, Facebook, YouTube and the web. Keep safe everyone, and God bless.